explain how, say you have this in your vehicle, your home, whatever. Right. Um, how do you know when to take it and, and all that type of thing? Well, um, optimally, mm -hmm. the government will tell you that you need to take something. But in all likelihood, the government is a giant hole in the ground now and where a bomb is hit. But if you're downwind from a nuclear event, and I don't mean next door to it, I'm saying, we'll say California goes up in giant mushroom clouds. We're here right now, we're sitting here in Ohio. We're downwind from a nuclear event. It's gonna take a few days to get here, but the fallout will hit us. And you wanna start taking this before the fallout gets to you. Now, if you are t already taking it, and there's not been a nuclear event, now you're wasting your thyroid blocker. So the best way is to take it, you know, like eight to 10 hours before the fallout gets to you. And you'll be taking it for another couple of weeks, but uh, fallout goes around the world and just keeps on going. And, and it has, radioactive iodine has a half-life of uh, 8.2 days. Hmm. So you're going to be taking it for at least a couple of weeks, at least a couple of half-lives. 